we are back here with another series, the start of the Old Republic series, where we create a new character and start off right. Now I've asked a lot of people on social media and such what we should do for here. The votes are in, and we have decided a Sith assassin. We're going to be Sith Pure Blood. Female. Just to show me where the fun and is. And dark side. So we're going to create a very strong dark side character. This is a good start for a character. That's not fear I smell, is it? Pretty. Pretty dark side. No, that wasn't so bad, was it? A little bit of a complexion going. We got the jewels. That's somewhat intriguing. And then we got long hair. We're all red. Just show me where the fuck. Feel a lot better with an actual outfit. And for the name. I'm just gonna pick a random name and see what That's not fear I smell, is it? Mina. There we go. Mina. And let us begin. There's no music cutting in because it's copyright and such. So, sorry about that. <laughs> We finally fit out a good outfit for her. I haven't done anything story wise or anything, I've just did all the behind the scenes extra stuff, unlocking uh, slots and such. Nothing you need to worry about. Now that we have our Dark Side Inquisitor all ready to go, I can show you the armor in just a bit. We're gonna get in and we're gonna start the story. Sorry, there's no music, like I said, copyright. I think I've improved the detail of this since the first time I played it. At least the camera angles have been a little bit brighter. Maybe it's because I got new technology with the new expansion pack. Or, well, latest, I would say. Ah, the last one to arrive is finally here. I hope you don't think you're special. It would be a shame if freedom went to your head. Or if you somehow got the idea you didn't need to pass your trials to become Sith. Lord Zash has tasked me with yeah, sorting through you refuse to find one worthy of being her apprentice. And I intend to do just that. Give us a chance. We can prove ourselves. We'll just see about that. Now the rest of you gutter trash already know your trial. Get going while I bring our latecomer up to speed. Watch your back, friend. And don't worry. It'll be alright. He can't kill us all. I'll attack from the front, you take him from behind, and we'll see how he fares. Uh, yeah. Looks like you can handle yourself. Now, slave, for your trial. There's a hermit named Spindrol who lives in the tomb of Ajunta Paul in the Valley of the Dark Lords. Spindrol's a lunatic, but Lord Zash sees him as some kind of prophet. Once you find him, he will test you. Fine. I will seek the insane hermit in the incredibly dangerous tomb and take his little test. But there. You know your task. 
Spindrel lives in the tomb of a Junta Paul in the Valley of the Dark Lords. Don't keep Spindrel waiting, slave. Well, alright. So, yeah, like I said, I have the companions, but I'm not going to use them until I get the story companions. Just because with them it makes it too easy. And that's just no fun. I'm also going to use the base gear that we get when we drop it. Because I do have I do have armors I could use and just give it to her and my save as well. But like I said, that's just too easy. I've already gotten everything from the uh, mailbox. Everything that you get when you make a new character. Which by now is a ton. Because I've been playing since release. So I get a ton of new stuff for every character. And the first thing we need to do is we need to figure out what we are. I'm gonna go for damage, and I think we're gonna go for hatred, just because I have not played that yet. So I'm curious to see just how good it is. It won't matter till level 10 anyway. And now we shall begin our tour. <laughs> I remember when we first, when I, mean, I first came in here, there was like a ton of people, enough to like lag the entire server. Cause I didn't, like back then I didn't have a decent computer, so when there's like 10, 15 people all crowded around one mission giver, it was insane. Let's start the game. one dead. Are stupidly. Yeah, it's supposed to go this way. Okay. Let's get our XP boost too. Just because we have one. Might as well use it. We're gonna get as high level as we can, as quickly as we can. Because I have legacy armor that basically. I have legacy armor that my other assassin uses as well. It's already well above flaking armor. With the armor you can buy from the fleet, but like game, I already have armor way higher than that. So I'm just gonna transfer that over to her when I get a chance to. Just because it's easier than having to wait. Need to dismiss you. Later. Not a whole lot going on for the uh, Sith Assassin, the Sith Inquisitor, just because they don't really have to do a whole lot of combat yet. Slave, welcome to my humble hole. You are here for your trial, yes? Learn the ways of the Sith from a doddering old man in a tomb, and hopefully to return to your master with the mark of my approval. Actually, I just came to get some fresh air. <laughs> Do you take me for a fool? No one comes into these tombs for the sheer pleasure of it. Not even me. No, they come for power. Because they sense that these tombs hold secrets of the dark side. And they do. But before you can learn them, you must pass a trial of blood. Survive this, and I will teach you what I know. Okay, now this is when I, we start combat. The companion, Are just you make sure? sure this isn't easy. And then there's their attack again. Chopping things, hacking. Don't have a whole lot of combos. So, it's kind of exciting. And we are done. Like I said, level 1, 2, 3 enemies are super easy Excellent. to take out. 
These former acolytes wanted nothing more than to earn their second chance for glory by killing you and taking your place. But your desire proved stronger, and their blood became the mantle of your victory. Well done. But you are not Sith yet. Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion, I gain strength. Through strength, power. Through power, victory. Through victory, my chains are broken. This is the Sith Code. Commit it to your heart, and you will have the strength to crush your enemies. Do you understand? There is nothing you can teach me that I don't already know, old man. Then leave. Return to Harkon and nurture your hatred for him. And use your fear of him to grow stronger. He may raise his fist to strike, but it is Lord Zash who determines where the blow will land. How do you know Harkon and Lord Zash? Both of them have been through here in my time, and they have gone their separate paths since. Now, go. Leave me to my rest. Great. Feeling better? Wish there was a way you could dismiss him Later. permanently. They, they really want you to use a companion, but I want to say no. Alright, let me fix something real quick, and I'll be right back. Alright, we're back. Just had to fix a little thing. Just scroll up and just have no chat because who cares? Actually, that doesn't matter. Because you're gonna scroll anyway. Tomb and we're level three. That's how easy it is to level up now. I'm gonna back back to the side. I didn't do any side quests either. I basically tried to avoid all killing. That's what took a whole day, but still. used to late game Sith Assassin where I can just hop in, stealth around, hop up to somebody and just slice them up. Hey, let's give you a boost. See, this is what I'm used to, but it hasn't been like this forever, until the server has merged. So many different people.
to give you a boost. We'll give you a boost. So where do we need to go? We need to go this way. Fifth Academy. Brings back old memories, doesn't it? Last one. Always the latecomer. Now we can see what the hermit thinks of you, slime. Hmm. Acolyte Cory. Step forward, please. Yes, Overseer. You are a weak, pathetic rodent, and even a lunatic like Spindrawl can see this. And that means... Meet our newcomer, Fawn Alt. This is real Sith strength, and he will tear you apart and crush your bones, slaves. Look on him. No connections left in the world but pure Sith blood. This, this is Lord Zash's future apprentice, not filth like you. We'll see how tough he is out in the tombs. Alone, with just me and my blade for company. Step this way, slave. I want to speak to you privately. The rest of you, get out of here. You know your trials. You too, Fon. Spindrel awaits. Now, listen to me. Spindrel is a lunatic. His approval means nothing. You are filth, and you will die. Is that clear? You think you scare me? You're nothing, and... Don't and forget it. Age. Now, your second trial. Lord Zash has requested a special trial for you, which you will no doubt fail. Go to Inquisitor Zinn in the jails. He will fill you in on the details, and most likely hasten your demise. The jails? He's not going to arrest me, is he? I don't want to see you again until you're back from the jails. That's all. Alright. You can see they already give us an XP boost too. They just want you to speed up through the process. So we're already level 4. Feeling better? I do have a hollow statue, which I'll use after we get off Corbine. But for now, I just want to uh, go to the class trainer, which it should be nearby, I think. Right. Last trainer, which should be somewhere around here. Yeah, they're on the same board. No, they're outside. I think. No, there's a cantina. Never mind, I can't read a map, apparently. Yeah, they are on the same board. What dark secret shall I share with you? Just like old times. This goes over here. We throw this. Actually, no, this one, because that's a knockback. And then this is. Yeah. That's what we needed. Be gone. We were in the tombs. When I was uh, starting out, I used to just, like just keep spamming last raid as I moved around so much. It's even better when you get light there because then your leg goes all the way around. Now oh, where were we going? Oh, right, all the way back there. I do also do have a uh, rocket boost, which I'll use when I get off Corbon. But for now, I'm just want to use. I just want to do everything as if I'm starting out. Don't okay. have anything except for just a cosmetic look of new armor. That's right it. Return to the old glory days of starting out the new character in the new legacy. I 
I'll go now. Acolyte, you've arrived. And not a moment too soon. Hakan has given me very specific instructions. You were raised as a slave, but must discard those traits and learn to control others. And I have just the task for that end. Meet this driveling excuse for an acolyte. He will be your victim. Ooh. Victim, hmm? This is where the Inquisitor This sounds coming. like it could be fun. This is not an idle diversion, acolyte. A short while ago, there was what we call an unauthorized murder here in the Academy. A rivalry among apprentices resulted in death. Interrogate him. Make him tell you who committed this crime at any cost. Cover your ears. This may get a little loud. Thank you for the warning, but I prefer to cherish every scream. This is where the punch gets in and we get to start on dark side. <sighs> Please, don't hurt me. I don't know anything. Scream, weakling. I want to hear your suffering. Please, don't do that again. I'll do anything. Should we do it again? Yeah, I think we do. What shouldn't I do again? This. Stop! Please! All right, I'll talk. You'll kill me, but I'll talk. The murderer is an apprentice named Essor Kayan. You have to protect me, or he'll kill me. That's not my problem. No. No. That's how it always is, isn't it? It's not anyone's problem until there's a lightsaber at your throat. Maybe if I'm lucky, Kane will put me out quickly. It's short, but yay. You don't have to tell me. I heard the name loud and clear, though I sorely wish I hadn't. Essor Kane. Kane's master is a dark council member. I'd be a fool to oppose him. But anyway, your trial here is done. I will send my commendations to Overseer Harkon. You may return to him now. No more torture. But I was just getting started. I know, I know. It's so hard to stop once you've started. Perhaps later, if you survive your trials. It has been most pleasant watching you work, Acolyte. Truly, I wish you the best of luck in your remaining trials. I wish there was more of these, like the torturing and getting information out of people. That would make the Sith Inquisitor storyline a little bit more inquisitorish. Rather than just. Well, you'll see when we get there. Going around the galaxy getting artifacts. I think, I think that's what it is. Like I said, I haven't played this story in forever, so it's been a while since I've done this. Anything. Well, well, well. I had been looking forward to cutting another one of you down, but it looks like I'll be spared the trouble. Unsurprisingly, Nylock has gone missing. Also, unsurprisingly, Fon has passed his first trial. It's only a matter of time before he tramples you all underfoot. I'll tear you apart where you stand, slave. Patience, Fon. An accident in the tombs is much more convincing. Now the lot of you know your next task. Go. I want to speak to Fon and our latecomer. No. Now, slave. Zin says you handled yourself expertly, and as much as I find this difficult to believe, Lord Zash is satisfied with his evaluation. Undoubtedly, Zin helped you in some way. But you will not have his help on the next trial. Both you and Fon will have trials of intellect. Trials that test your ability to apply your understanding of the Force to solve a slave to be a match for me in intellect. I've been trained under the greatest teachers. Calm down, Fon. I certainly do not expect this slave to be a match for you. That's why you will have separate trials. You don't need to do that. Truly, your generosity astounds. You're only digging your own grave. Fon, you will go to the library on the second floor of the academy and translate the following texts for Lord Zash. Yes, Overseer. Slave, deep in the ancient, monster-infested tomb of Marker Ragnos, there is a holocron filled with dark secrets and encased in a great stone monument. No one has figured out how to release the holocron from its stone prison in over a thousand years. You will bring this holocron to me, 
or you will die. The more you make me hate you, the stronger I become, Harkon. And one of these days, I'm going to be strong enough to crush you. You will never be strong enough, slave. You will bring back the Holocron, or hope that the spirit of Marka Ragnos himself returns to end your miserable existence. Now go. Did they actually give you a focus? Because they must have updated the world since the advanced Feeling better? became the default process. Because before you were just an Inquisitor and then at level 10 you upgraded to either the Sorcerer or the Assassin. And then you get these, uh, the focus and... I guess the... Yeah, I guess they do have focus, don't they? I keep thinking like a Jedi Knight or Sith Warrior, where you get a an extra offhand, or like a mercenary, where you get an extra offhand. I guess it doesn't matter for this. Never mind. I'm just rambling on then. Service, my lord. Oh, look at this scoreboard. A lot better than in Kotor One. tracks you're meant to walk across when you don't need a mount. Imagine back in the day where you don't even have mounts level 1. Someone else is also going without a companion. But they use a lightsaber, so it doesn't count. Yay! Oh, there is. There's a bonus. 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 There's a Whoa. Do these guys count? <laughs> no, they gather the same bonus. back and get that one minion that one I got your back enemy before I go just so that way you can get one of these bonuses done <laughs> Ooh, <we got> <laughs> 250 uh, cards. that's good because that means there are some of these achievements that I would otherwise have to grind for I can now get because I'm gonna redo everything all over again Here's level 6. Ah! 
in a challenge. Later. What you need to do here. Peace is a lie. There is only passion. I don't know if that was right or not. Right in the back. That wasn't too bad. And I can't dismiss you. Oh well. I'm gonna be cheating for this one. Are you sure? Um just open, damn it. Oh. That's right, it was something so easy. All you had to do was like shoot lightning at it or something. Now I remember. This will help. If that's what you want. And now we go all the way back. Wait, 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 wait. I don't have quick travel on my hot bar yet. I will quick travel because you could do that before. And it's much quicker. Back to that way. And give you a boost. Just stuttering right there. Give you a boost. I like to give uh, new players boosts just because when I was a new player, nobody would boost me. And I missed having the critical strike chains, the endurance. Although it doesn't matter too much now, since most people are level locked and stat locked on this the planet. Will help. So as soon as you reach you better not level, be wasting my locked. time, slave. You better have the holocron. Hmm. A fake. Or stolen from the library, probably. I'll deal with you later. Now, I believe it's time for another demonstration. Gur, step forward. Yes, Overseer. Fon. Kill him with pleasure, Overseer. Don't uh. kill him and not me. Let Gur be an example to you. Fon destroyed him easily, like he will destroy all of you. Are there any other objections? You're heartless, Harkon. How can you be so cruel? I am Sith. Something you will never be. Now the rest of you know the next trial. Go. You, slave, stay here. Now, slave, you think yourself pretty clever getting that holocron, don't you? Stop with your taunts and give me my next trial. If you wish to prolong your life, you will not make demands of me again, slave. Now, for your trial. The last, darkest secrets of Tulak Horde are buried in his tomb. Lord Zash wants this text. But the final resting place of the dead lord is not easily trespassed. You will not be the first to die there. Is there a reason you keep sending me into the tombs? Lord Zash's research is her own business, and no one else's. You're not fit to know. Any other stupid questions? Wait a minute. You don't know, do you? You're as in the dark as I am. Lord Zash hasn't told you anything, has she? You are begging for death, slave. Do not come back here until you've gotten the text from Tulak Horde's tomb. Out of my sight, slave! That end of murder, so... 
I don't know why he's not, why he's leaving me alive. Other than the fact that I'm the hero. Can we get more ammo? Unless of you. If that's what you want. And now we go back out into the tombs. First we level up. We get new abilities. Each level in the early time gets you too, so many abilities. And you get no more until like level 50. There's like 15, you get one at 25, and then you get nothing until 50. At last, a worthy so disciple. We're done and our stuff. Yay! A bit of stun and shift C. Be gone. And now we have a stealth. Now we can avoid all those enemies. Except the moves, so we shouldn't do that here. They just left their hollow dancer around. Okay then. That was a tram for another place, but now we just need to follow these back. Oh, there's three things we need for it. This one is more over here. Okay, so we'll click this thing and then go over here. Chest is going as well. Back when security chests actually mattered, tons of people would crowd around them. Because they give a ton of late game credits. Like 20,000, 30,000 credits. Now they just give you small crafting materials. And a stem that I'll use now because I don't have another stem on me. Oh my god. I'm go this way. There's no enemies here because everyone keeps playing them out. Need to keep responding. Okay, and we'll go this way first. Just get we're on the other way. Let's kill these guys for fun. And the loot guy's fun. I give him a boost even though he's in the AK. Are you not gloves? 
Now we just have random gloves. They don't do much. They don't have their stats, but they do have their armor. Should find a merchant soon and sell off all the junk. These guys would be easy to take out. That's another thing you have to worry about is just random guild and invitations. Because everybody wants to get that. There's so many people in their guild so they get the XP boost. But we don't need the XP boost. We're in the long journey. And it's easy to level up anyway. You don't need more XP. Yes. Yes, remarkable. Magnificent. You. You slave. What? No. Acolyte. You're the one who brought me this magnificent holocron from the tomb of Marco Ragnos, yes? Is there something wrong? Unbelievable. One thousand years buried in that tomb. The Sith lords passing it by. And then the most unlikely person comes along. Tell me, how did you manage it? Easy. Open it. Do we lie because we're dark side or do we just say easy? I had to sacrifice seven Tukata and eat their hearts. Really? How strange. It didn't work when I tried it. That's Your work so it. far in bringing back this holocron and now the text from Tulak Horde's tomb has me intrigued. I am watching your progress eagerly. I have high hopes for you, Acolyte. Sky high. Really? Harkon seems to favor Fawn. Harkin's only purpose is to weed out the weak. Beyond that, his opinion means nothing. Good luck, Acolyte. Good luck. I got your back. All right. I was just about to send Fawn off. What delayed you, slave? Well, first Lord Zash stopped me to tell me how amazing I am, and then we got talking, and I guess I lost track of time. Just like a slave to make up stories. Lord Zash would crush you like a gizka if you ever crossed her path. You're not worthy of her presence. Now, did you collect the text from Tulak Horde's tomb? Of course. As always, I'm brilliant. Give it here. No doubt it's been badly damaged. It's what we get for sending a careless lowlife to do a Sith job. Isn't that right, Fawn? What are we waiting for, Overseer? Why don't we kill this wretch now? You have a big mouth, slave, but no combat skills. I don't want to see you again until you've satisfied the Korriban instructors. The training facility is on the second floor of the Academy and is usually reserved for the Dark Lords and their apprentices. This is not 
A promotion. And you are not to speak to anyone except the training master when you are up there, understand? You are not fit for their presence. Please tell me Fawn can come. We'll have so much fun. Fawn has been training at combat his whole life. He was born to be Sith. You are just as likely to chop your own arm off as not, slave. Now get going to the second floor training grounds. You don't want to keep the instructors waiting. <laughs> I don't want to see you until you've been to the training grounds. Second floor, slave. More armor. No companion, no. Are you sure? I am very sure. Oh, we're not doing any of the extra companions, just the story ones. Hello there, friend. You remember my brother? I think this this old thing. Is okay. Up, so just want to make sure we don't have a companion going. Hello there, friend. You remember my brother and me from downstairs? We've Harkin, right? Sorry, it had to be this way. We don't like it any more than you do. Well, maybe a little more. Now, now, you really don't know whether I like this or not. I'm sorry, girl. I liked you. I really did. The Harker made us a deal, see? We kill you, we go home. You will regret that. We don't want to. But we know we can't beat Fon, and we'll never be Sith. At least this way we can go home, alive. Quiet, Balak. The time for talk is past. Fight for your life, Acolyte. Oh, this will be easy. That was too easy. And yes, our companion spawned that's anyway, what you want. even without her, it was too easy. Now we get to go back. Good as new. Are you sure? Well, well. Look who shows up at long last. I half expected to hear you'd crossed some Dark Lord upstairs and finally got yourself killed. None of the others have shown up either. I assume they're dead by now, which means you and Fawn are the last ones. Speaking of Fawn, he seems conspicuously absent. You only wish it, slave. No. You took so long returning, I sent Fawn ahead. Your final trial will be to retrieve an ancient map from the innermost chamber of Naga Sado's tomb, which has never been breached in thousands of years. But before you get the map, you'll have to awaken an ancient assassin called Dashard that sleeps in the tomb. You cannot access the map without him. Understand? What exactly is a Dashard? They're a lost race of assassins that the ancient Sith used to devour their force-using enemies. This one will probably eat you the moment he's freed. Well, so oh, fun. and one more thing. You'll be competing with Fawn for this map. Whoever brings it back will be Lord Zash's apprentice. The other will die. And Fawn's already started, so my advice? Run, slave. Run. Ahem. <clears throat> one moment, please. Lord Zash, what are you doing here? Overseer, are you implying that I, a Lord of the Sith, don't have the right to go where I please within the Academy of the Sith? No, of course not, Lord Zash. Good. I saw the last Acolyte arrive. I wanted to see the hopefuls off on their final trial. Where's, um, what's his, the red one, Fawn? He finished his trial early, so I sent him on rather than keeping him waiting for this... Pity. I just finished translating the wonderful text this acolyte brought from Tulak Hord's tomb, and it's most illuminating. I don't know that the map can be retrieved without it. Uh-oh. Fawn's in trouble. It's too late. Fawn's already left. 
You can't just... W give one acolyte an unfair advantage over the other? Overseer, when has being Sith ever been about being fair? Yeah, now, my dear acolyte, here is what you must do to free the Deshard. There are rods scattered throughout the tomb of Naga Sado. These rods are the keys to the chamber where the ancient assassin is imprisoned. You will need to place the rods in the chamber door and electrify them. I don't know exactly the reason, but it is clear that you will not be able to retrieve the map without the Deshard. But be careful. He is very dangerous. I have yet to meet a danger I can't defeat. I will return when both acolytes are back from the tomb. You will not do anything further to affect the outcome of the trial. Understood? Yes, Lord Zash. Good. And good luck, Acolyte. Your trial is in the tomb of the sun. Now we get to go back into If we should probably go Yeah, we should probably get a level up first. At last, a worthy disciple. Be and gone. there's our CC removal. Now those stones won't be nearly as bad. Oh, no. Wait, no, this is the, uh, this is the stack. That's right, you activate this, and you gain a critical strike chance for your next channel ability, which the Sith Assassin has, like, one channel ability, I think. Or is it just... Oh, wait, no, this one's the one where you, uh, yeah, you activate this and you heal, and then you use a force attack. Yeah, critical hits. See ya. But it's not channeled. I guess they changed it. it. Used to be just channeled force abilities. Follow route is confirmed. That was back when the uh, Sith Assassin had force lightning too, though. So it mattered. what you want. the rest of them Quest. 
Seems like we're gonna have to clean out this. Well, maybe. Oh, yeah. Looks good. They don't even notice it. We're right behind them and they don't even notice us. What's your team? Let's get this yard going. Mm -hmm. oh, I thought this guy was... Yeah, good. Okay. Then we need those last rod. Wait, there's a... Bender up here. Medical attention. Yeah, I really want to sell all this stuff. Lovely. Be well. So we're going to the door, let's go in. Oh. We go this way, we can push him off. No, because we don't need you. I'll go now. Yay! Okay, 
kill these guys. Amin's why heist fools go when Dida seek from Tauhans. Ip Taukida, Melaswe Sama, word sign in Merem Nai, Saigat Rawa Dida. Tagasar Chais embarks prize war Peren, Swase Ik Bus Karadida. You don't sound exactly sane. Ni Pate Uvaro is sand and Sware Kanidede, Akja Swaluda is. Aba Barna Habans, Glaubena. Ni in Usakwai, Uisi Terrans Apipao. Was Jabe wise Jabe, prophetis, Wisan's Jagara Haitang. I hate to be the one to break it to you, but Tulak Horde is dead. He places Amin's Wai Hai's fools, Gawen Dida seek from Tauhans, Abro Gatua, Ina in Lausolam, Jagasatida to Ima. Wadi in Warpai and Parlai Kain. Name in my dens. Ipsic air by Kudana, Jaus air by Rojandan, in Bise Wistai. In Bizoze Waitai Spila Press in Kretai. In Bise Ewanata, Atragata in Jais. Obey or perish. Sisunja, Targi Skolan. And now we have the Swiss Commandant I'm just going to deal with just going to deal with damage. We go this way, right? Yeah. I feel like it was my
get you low health. Low health I mean low health. So low level honestly. Back when a hundred was such a great number. I think we'll just get this one, guys. And I think I'm just gonna move can build the damage just so that way it doesn't take forever to get the Please early on. Basically, it's an AoE damage that heals you. Yay. And now we have the map, and now we go all the way back to the... I can't wait. I'm telling you, Overseer, it cannot be done. I went into the tomb, I saw the Deshard across the chasm, but I could not get to it. But the map, the map! Lord Zash is adamant she will not take an apprentice without the map! I'm telling you, Lord Zash wants the impossible. No one is ever going to get that map! You don't mean this map, do you? The map? And... the Deshard? Get that monster out of here this instant! And give me the map! No, it's not possible. You wretch, you filth, you must have cheated somehow. How did you do it? How did you release the monster? Sai galut saira, iswis us uf bandan ja atnam in puidangarja. Right. You. you must have cheated. You must have. You'll pay for this! Fawn, patience. You will have your chance at this whelp. After you personally deliver this map to Lord Zash. No, just kill him. Eat them both, Cam. Don't be that way soon. Keep your pet at bay for just a moment, Acolyte. I would have a word with Fawn. Lord Zash? Yes, Fawn. Now, where's my map? Uh, here, Lord Zash. R right here. That's what you found. found it for me, Fawn? How wonderful. He couldn't have found it if he tried. Silence! Fon will tell me what happened, won't you, Fon? You wouldn't dare lie to me, would you? Because it would be a shame for me to discover that you lied to me. Now, one more time. Did you bring this map back from Nagasado's tomb? I, uh, I, no, uh, no. No, I, I didn't, I, I didn't. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry. Hearken, you fool. In any other group, for any other lord, this young man would have torn the other acolytes to shreds. What were you trying to prove? That you could outsmart me? That you knew better than me what kind of person I wanted for an apprentice? You fool! <laughs> There's your pet, Harkon. Clean this mess up. Apprentice, meet me in my chambers upstairs. Yay. As you say. This is not the end. 
Without Lord Zash to save you, you're nothing. I have connections that will hunt you wherever you go. That's big talk for a worm like you. Get out of my sight, slave. Your new master is waiting for you upstairs. Get out of my sight, slave. He's still not like me. What? No, still do no dash. Can't remember if there's anything else we need to do before we leave Corbin. I think we're just gonna let this episode continue on until we do. The publisher. Gun over there and double up, but I'll get that later. My magnificent new apprentice. Congratulations are in order, I believe. Thank you for giving me this opportunity. You've earned it, my apprentice. Now, I was just looking over this astonishing map you brought back, and I can tell we have a lot of work ahead of us. You mean, I have a lot of work ahead of me? You think I don't work, apprentice? I'd remind you that there is more to being Sith than crushing Tugata skulls and mulling about dark tombs. You must meet me on Drummond Cars. There we can talk more. Why? Why must we go there? That is where the map leads, though I likely would have taken you there anyway. The capital of the Sith Empire is a good place for an apprentice to start. I will meet you in my chambers in the Citadel in Cars City. There we can speak more freely of the work ahead without the fear of unfriendly ears. This is the lightsaber I had as an apprentice. I want you to have it. I shall wreak havoc with it wherever I go. Magnificent. No doubt you will. Now, remember, my chambers, the Citadel, Drummond Cars. It's imperative that we get to work on this as soon as possible. Stop right there, slave. Darth Scotia has a message for you. Give me the message. The message is this. You will not go to Drummond Cass. Everything you've done here, everyone you dealt with, Lord Zash included, is insignificant. Darth Scotia has eyes and ears on Corriban. He knows what your master is up to and he is displeased, to say the least. On Corriban, Lord Zash may have her way. But on Drummond Cars, it's a different story. So you see, you have to die. Kemp, what is it you do to force users again? Gibai Iswis Aman Hanguijins. Autosin, is that a Dashard? Maybe this isn't such a good idea. Coward! Fight, you fool! <laughs> Oh, I'm instantly fighting. Okay, good. I'll just pick up a random... A random customization. I don't know what this one is. Oh, it's the right one. Alright. But yeah, you get to actually use a lightsaber. Although I have my own... I have my own lightsaber that I'm gonna throw on there. But we'll just use this one for this fight. Yeah. Oh. And then in the next episode, I'll grab my goat, my chicken, and find you. But guess what? It's not the end. Because you guys, down in the comments below, get to vote for what color the light table will be. I'll throw a little poll down in the description. And I'll let you guys decide what you want. Have a little interaction with our series after all. Okay, so let's go get some new abilities. 
At last, a worthy disciple. Oh, Big go. Go. That's the... Yeah, that's the CC removal. Yay. Gives us um, three more potions. I don't need it on this saber. I'll use the meal one. Wait, now we have one. Who is it? I'll have full and modded gear too. I'll just use these gear for level one on full band. When we get to Gromit Cross, it'll be so much easier. We'll actually have some real gear that I'll probably come later. time going through the rest of the story mode. Hopefully eventually getting it up to uh, the expansion pack story modes as well as some of the flashpoints. We have been looking pretty good here. We shall see you in the next episode. And don't forget to vote what color lightsaber you want as well as if you want our Sith warrior or Sith assassin to have their helmet on or off. See the polls in the description and we'll see you all in the next episode. Have fun.